Hello, Corey and Terry. I uh, wanted to go over the few things. You guys, it's easier just to visually show you. That way you guys have time to look at it and dissect it. And we don't lose it to translation. But um, a couple things we're wanting. This video, I'm only going to be letting you kind of know the Excel export we want. We want two exports. One for new orders and one for our inventory. So I was thinking we could go production, um, excuse me, uh, production here, order QC, and we can pull all this information out, right? I'd sort it by new order and give me an export on this page that would be great just you know up here somewhere where you guys I don't care really where you put it just um, give me the chance to export all right here for new orders um, and then if I wanted to actually just let me do any if I want to do new orders and then production I can export them both or just, I need an export on this page second I need inventory so materials and inventory so I need an export on this page as well for all roles. Here, here, I mean, I could probably, this one I actually, is, yeah, I need it for all roles, so I need an export page here. Maybe I would go in here and I would sort 0.12 to 0 0.016, right? And then I would, which is kind of weird, because that should be going, oh, because I don't have a point. point, point. And then I would hit export, and I would get all of this information out to Excel. Then I need the same for my finished sheets. And I need the same for my finished rolls. All right, so this is the export video. Just wanted to show it to you. Um, this is going to help us a lot with nesting. So we'll be doing a huge amount of automation out of the system by allowing this. Without that, I have to but have to have you guys automate everything, which I think would be too difficult and time consuming. So we're saving both of us a significant amount of time. So the faster we can get this, it would be the uh, be better for us. Um, all right, so that's it. Thanks.